I am here at the GLAAD Awards, so take a look. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Well, you look fantastic. Are you excited tonight? I am. It's my first award show in like two years. Like, so it's it's crazy to be around this many people, but I'm like into it. I'm into raw dog in the air with everybody. Well, you're looking fantastic. Thank what you. does the GLAAD Awards mean to you? It just means like, talk about people who don't mess around. They're such a powerful entity and they've made themselves indispensable. And it just feels so great to be recognized by them and to be like with them. And I don't know, they're just a powerhouse. They're very chic. We are an amazing person, and thank you for doing what you do. We love you. Thank you. Have a great night. Thank you. You too. Our, our community is doing some amazing things, and I'm a part of it, and I love it. Well, you're looking absolutely amazing tonight, thank and you, you do bring a lot of joy into the community. Who dressed you tonight? I did. You did? But yes. You know, they, they, don't like to, they don't like to design for a big girl, so I have to handle me and make sure that I make a statement that I'm a part of the community, baby, and I'm going to turn a look, you know, Every now and again, it's going to be a little nail, it's going to be a little hair situation, maybe a dress situation. <laughs> we have to do it again, they screwed up. Oh, you look it's just a, a celebration of of our community of LGBTQ plus people and it's so important and special to me as as a married gay man but also as as a dad as well I get to Is that right? Is. Well, as husbands. As, as husbands. Yes. Well, as husbands. Wow. Yes. When did you guys get married? Last week. Last week. <laughs> it's fresh. It's fresh. How are you guys? Are you excited tonight? We're so excited to be here at the Glad Media Awards because it's all about this. It's about representation in the media. What it looks like to be a gay couple in the media and show show the world what LGBTQ plus community is all about. Well, you certainly are a beautiful looking couple. Thank I, you. My God, you look like the two on the top of a cake or something. You. you know, we're, we're cake the, 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 the cake toppers. We came as cake toppers tonight. Yeah. Well, have a great time, guys. Thank you so much. Thanks. I'm just, I'm just super excited to be even nominated and to be here with all these amazing people. <laughs> it's fantastic. And uh, who dressed you guys tonight? My friend Matt, Matt Yarbo. Um, we've been to college together, but now he lives in Paris and, and he styles so many people. And I, I sent him a quick text. I was like, "Get me together." I love it how you've got no shirt on. I think that's great. It Thank looks. You. Like a tall honor, but I wouldn't. Okay. I wouldn't mess with you. You're like a deep. And I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> with that, with that laugh, I would not at all. <laughs> Darling, you excited about tonight? I'm very excited. You know, uh, it's my first time hosting. I am a former recipient. I won a Glad Award last year, which is really exciting. I'm nominated again tonight, and I'm one of the hosts, so it feels really amazing to be here. You're going to have a few champagnes tonight. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking. Have a few. I'm eight bottles in. <laughs> Good, you look beautiful. You look beautiful too. This is like a self-admiration society here, well, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> and I, I hear a little whisper that you put this little ensemble together, is that right? I did. I, well, this is a Tom Brown. I'm wearing Tom Brown. Tom Brown? Oh my God. And you did you actually stylize it yourself? I added some elements, the shoes, I forget where they're from. The socks are from my kilt ensemble. My mother's Scottish. Is your mother Scottish? Ooh, is your house as hot as hell? Very in good. summer. Very, is that very good? good. <laughs> well, Scotland, the only country that requires a uh, queer history in their all their schools. Oh my God, is that right? Who knew? I love that. That's fantastic. Well, you both put this together. Now you're a lovely yeah. couple. Tell us about that. We've been married for four years. Uh, together for seven, four and a half. 
live in Los Angeles. He moved out to be with me when I started working out here. Got two cats. It's a cliche. I'm excited about tonight. So excited. This is my aware. first award show, and so no better way to start with Vlad. You know? Well, you're nominated tonight, right? Yes, for best drama for the award. Yeah. Well, I hope you win. You're looking fantastic. Hi, darling. Look at you. She's looking amazing. I'm from Australia, darling. Where are you from? Brazil, Sao Paulo. Oh my God. I want to get a Brazilian later on. <laughs> Find him a oh my god, let's try and fix that up. Oh, oh, we got it. Look at that. I just saved a fashion faux pas. Are you excited about tonight? I am, yes. You're being nominated. I am. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, so I did this show with Vice. Uh, it is about trans issues around the world. I am the host of the first episode, um, which really focused on the murders against black trans women in the States. We well, are doing an amazing job. Fabulous. I'm Johnny Black to call on the media industry to do better. Let's change the narrative when it comes to people living with things like me. And tonight we are going to celebrate all of those media, music, and more of the accepting of the LGBTQIA. Michaela J became the first transgender woman to be nominated for an Emmy in a leading role. And then the, the first trans actor to win a Golden Globe. Father for seeing and loving me. Hey, mommy. That's